Very good morning to you. Thanks for spending part of your Sunday morning with us. A local business best known for its pancakes and some very famous customers who have enjoyed eating them is celebrating a recent financial grant from KeyBank. Pamela's P&G Diner was one of 14 businesses to receive this recognition for their positive impact on their staff and the community. Todd Moles is president and market president of KeyBank. Pamela Cohen and Gail Klingensmith are co-owners of Pamela's P&G Diner. And they're with us this morning on the Sunday Business Page. Hey, welcome to the show. Congratulations, ladies. Thanks, this, John. Thank you. I, you know, I, we're such fans of Pamela's. I, who in Pittsburgh doesn't like to go to Pamela's? And so I'm going to come to you in just a second. But, Todd, I want to start with you. Why this kind of recognition? What is KeyBank up to in singling out a great small business uh, like this one? Well, John, if you remember, uh, over a year and a half ago, we announced our National Community Benefits Plan. And as part of that plan, we allocated $2.5 billion to small business. In May, we recognized a Small Business Month. And as part of that, we had a contest, key, Small Business is Key, and where we nominated small businesses across our footprint, really across the country. And Pamela was uh, lucky enough to be the award winner. And it was based on really the, the impact they have on our community, the positive impact they have, and based on volunteerism, their mission, uh, employment, and everything about the background of that business. And Pamela, as we were happy to, to say, was an award winner uh, in our market. Well, there's no doubt that it's an award winner when you go to eat there. I mean, you've got the best crepes, uh, I guess they're crepe pancakes, I'm not sure, hot cakes you call them. It works. It works. They're great. <laughs> they are so fabulous. But there's a lot of other good food there as well. And uh, you've really made Pamela's an institution. How did that come about? What do you think? <laughs> How did that come about? But, uh, I th just uh, hard work and one, one restaurant at a time. One restaurant at a one time. One restaurant at a time. time. Uh, we're not, we're not uh, schooled in business. And uh, so we didn't have a big overall plan and projections but uh, you know we did it one restaurant at a time and we you're now up to, out as, you're we're six, up to Pamela's six Pamela's and, six Pamela's. and, and uh, the new modern Jewish bistro for the weekend brunches right. and uh, La, Feria. La Feria the Peruvian arts and crafts which is above the shady side store you know you have attracted such an audience of folks that that uh, of regular Pittsburghers that now the politicians for the last number of years have all been going to you. What do you make of that? I think they like the Obamas. <laughs> yeah, they like, yeah, I think it's, <laughs> it, it's been kind of crazy that uh, it's surreal that it's happened. Well, it's not, but, not uh, just President Obama who went. I, um, you've had others No, well. we've had many. We've had the we've Prime had Minister of Japan. The Prime Minister of Japan? Yes. Huh? Um, yeah, we've had we've Smokey had a Robinson. lot. <laughs> Smokey Robinson. He's not a politician. He's not no, a politician. No, he's but he's a, <laughs> no, but but he's a celebrity. He's a great yeah. Singer. yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And, so. and Senator Casey and Joe Biden. Yeah. Right, right. Joe Biden, yeah. I think I may have been there to cover that when yeah. he, he popped in there. I mean, the fact is, though, that one of the reasons I'm assuming, Todd, that you gave this award, it's not just because this is a fabulous place to eat and they get all these celebrities coming in, including presidents of the United States, but it's because of the way they run their operation and treat their staff. Um, pretty unusual, I think, for small business. In some small businesses, don't do what you folks do in terms of benefits and the like. Was that part of the consideration? Uh, absolutely part of it. And, and, and I would add on to that also how they give back to the community and the organizations and the nonprofits that, that they support and the impact that they make into the community. Right. And, and I would add, and, and they're, um, they're very modest when they talk about their business, but if you look at, at business in, in our market, we're very appreciative of the large businesses that we have here, the institutions we have, or even our sports teams. Teams. But if you look at what the character of our, our community, it's made up of small businesses right. like Pamela's. Right. And uh, Pam and Gail, you have been, uh, you know, aside from being institutions in Pittsburgh over the years, and maybe you don't want to be referred to in that way. No, but, I, <laughs> that I always still, makes us seem a I little. Still, I still remember the first time it happened. It was like, <laughs> whoa, we're yeah. old. Yeah, right, right. Uh, well, but you're the fun place. I mean, I, I have to admit, and, and Todd and I share this in common. We go, we love eating at Pamela's. Um, 
Sometimes it shows a little, a little too much here. Yes. But the fact is that your employees love working at Pamela's. You provide benefits that some small businesses don't do. Can you tell us about that a little bit? Well, I think that we were the, um, we started a long time ago. And it, the minute we, uh, we were able to afford possibly to give insur uh, insurance, health insurance. Health insurance, right. We've all, uh, we started it. It was a lot cheaper then than it is now, but sure. and uh, and then we did and then that. we did. We've always done paid vacation. And you know, a lot of it you yeah, talk about is, fast food restaurants and all. You get none of this stuff. No. And no. and you're, you've said we also a, did the four hundred one k. Yes. Oh, you and with an employer and we contribution. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Fabulous. So we have always tried to give back to our employees. They give to us. We give back to them. Yeah. I mean, you, we're nothing without. Them. We're nothing they are without nothing them. without them. Right. Yeah. Well, uh, you know, that is so much the right attitude. And fortunately, it is a minority attitude among a lot of employers. And so I really congratulate you on that. Uh, we only have a, f a few seconds left. I got to ask, what's, what's new and great coming to Pamela's? Are you going to have a few more places, locations? You've already got six. Uh, anything new on the menu? I mean, <clears throat> anything, what's, what's happening? Well, right now, uh, <laughs> we have it. We have a junior partner now that we've taken in, and um, we always ask Michelle. Things things have come up. We've still been offered locations, um, mm -hmm. and uh, we check with her because it's she's, about her she's energy about now. She's about twenty five years younger than us, with, so. with right. two kids. Yeah. Does it, is there a difference in the customers? I mean, do the millennials want something different no. than, than the baby boomers like me? <laughs> No, that hasn't well, happened. I think to a certain extent there is some uh, difference. You see what's popping up, these new small places, these new restaurants where you right. get your, oh, you know, your specialty oatmeals, et cetera. But I think oh, everybody that healthy is food. Still, they want all yeah. that. They want but that celery. Time, and, but anytime and we, we want put the it home in, fries. But anytime we uh, put it in, nobody orders it anyhow. So <laughs> <laughs> what why, they say why and what they could, do is you know, two different things. I'm in search of the perfect acai -E bowl. Acai bowl. Acai. Oh, acai. -E. Acai -E bowl. Uh -huh. I was well, just in California. Well, good, yeah, good luck with so that. I'm, uh, <laughs> ladies, thank you so much for being with us. Congratulations. Todd, thank you for all you do at KeyBank and for recognizing, yes, obviously, you. an thank institution you, in thank Pittsburgh. You. Great to have you on the show. Thank when you. the Sunday Business Page continues, how a graduate from California University of Pennsylvania is giving back to his alma mater in a very big way. Stick with us.